Hello and welcome to a SOLIDWORKS video by NCCS. You should have received this 2018 SOLIDWORKS media disc, or if you prefer a soft copy, you can download it from our customer portal, the link of which will be provided below. When installing SOLIDWORKS, the first page that should open is the Welcome to SOLIDWORKS Installation Manager. As you can see on the screen, Individual on this computer has been selected as the default option. You can also choose Download and Share All Files. The advantage of selecting this option is that when it downloads the files, you can then share it with multiple users without them having to re-download it themselves. Next, you will want to enter your SOLIDWORKS license number, which is provided to you on the SOLIDWORKS customer portal. Now you will be provided with two options as seen on the screen. It is very important that you choose the Create New Installation option. This option allows you to run both SOLIDWORKS 2017 and SOLIDWORKS 2018 in parallel. However, if you are ready to fully migrate to SOLIDWORKS 2018, then select the Upgrade SOLIDWORKS as highlighted on the screen. Now we come to the summary section of the installation. Here we will go over the four options provided. Product, Download Options, Installation Location, and Toolbox. Under Products, you can view and edit add-ons downloading with your SOLIDWORKS package. However, as SOLIDWORKS automatically selects all add-ons you are entitled to, you don't really need to explore this section. You can, however, if you feel like being thorough. In Download Options, check that the operation is set to Download and Install. If this is the case, we can move on to the next step. Now we will need to change the installation location. We do this so that when you download SOLIDWORKS 2018, there are now two separate folders, one for the SOLIDWORKS 2018 files and the other for the SOLIDWORKS 2017 files. Select the Change button, then Browse, then select Create New Folder. Title this folder SOLIDWORKS 2018 or whatever title you think best. Open New Folder and then click OK. Once this is done, you can then return to Summary. Now for the Toolbox portion of the tutorial. Expand your Toolbox, click Change, Select Browse, Create New Folder. Title your folder SOLIDWORKS Data 2018 or whatever title you see fit. Open the folder, click OK, and then return to Summary. Once you're on the Summary page, you'll want to expand all options just to double check that everything is in order. Once you are satisfied that everything is as it should be, click Download and Install.